This week I'm fly fishing for pike at Chew Valley Lake, a man-made reservoir nestled at the foot of the Mendip Hills in Somerset and providing Bristol City with its water. With over a thousand acres of water to explore, it offers some of the best pike fishing in the country. It is renowned for big pike and the current lake record stands at £44.6, ounce, just £2.7 ounce less than the current British record. I was due to fish here a month ago with Sam Pitcher, but bad weather forced us onto the Somerset levels where I managed to catch a new PB pike. Seeing a pike grab my fly by my feet was heart-stopping stuff, but seeing big pike follow a Chew Valley Lake is not that unusual. But getting them to take the fly is another matter altogether. They are educated catch and release fish, and pike don't care for lures or flies they've seen before. About 49 gents. Thanks. Is that a lucky one, is it? Look, it, it always, it, that one's always lucky. <laughs> yeah. 49's not holding it today. <laughs> Definitely lucky. Morning. Good morning. Do you want to do you want to hop in and Thank I'll you. tuck that in? Too. Hiking, eh? Ta. That's the plan. Give it a go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Right, so Kit is an Echo reel, a Gray's uh, ten weight, nine foot ten weight, and I'm using an Airflow Ridge Die Three line. It's just loop to loop, 25 pound fluoro to 40 pound um, AFW wire. It's all loop to loop with a clip on the end, and that's uh, some weird dodgy pack fly that I tied. It does seem to catch fish. Made out of those hairband and some ink. We're going to start off here. I can't tell you where it is for obvious reasons. No, not really. So Heron's Green, that's the road bridge. There's Sam. His grandpa chair, which he made himself. It's very comfy. I bet it is damn sight more comfy than what I'm sat on, just sat on a plank of wood. Hi. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> All the boats are booked, but there's not a soul in sight. Which we love. Which probably means we're in the wrong place. <laughs> we don't care. Very few pike have been caught in the weeks leading up to this day. And in the first two hours, we got absolutely soaked by a relentless drizzle. I've been accused of uh, only going fly fishing with Sam because he's left-handed, <laughs> but it's not true, because he also brings lunch. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Oh, and we've caught bugger all. I did have one, a little one, fell off. Yeah, the wind's died down, it's lovely now. Excellent, so Sam pitches now into his uh, first ever Chew Valley Pike. We were just saying how the um, boats are ignoring the reed line, so we've come in a bit closer and there's a lot of trout in here, but there's um, first cast, wasn't there? First cast, that's brilliant. This is when you see a monster come and eat it. Well, oh, the fly nice. works, Charlie, and it's, I must admit, uh, it's very satisfying catching one on one you've made. Definitely. Oh. Do you want me to net it? Or are you happy to do it? Hello. Open up a bit, isn't it? I was going to handball him out, but it's shallow here, isn't it? Well done, Sam. Cheers, mate. That's wicked. I'm happy with that. That's, that's off the mark, so that's good. Are we going extra large pickled gherkin or cucumber? <laughs> <laughs> I've had gherkins bigger than that, to be honest. Have you now? On Sam's homemade fly. Well done, it's lovely. It looks terrible. It's your first Two Valley Point mind. <laughs> it's good. Well done. Happy? Yes. Well done, I'm well pleased. Let's look good. Let's get a bigger one. Don't, doesn't feel big, no. It's kiting a, a little bit to the right. Just swinging around the other side to me, it'd be easier than that. Not sure what size it is yet. Yeah, well, don't let it lower you because it could be a big one. It could be bigger. It's, uh, it's sitting deep, isn't it? Sitting a bit deeper, yeah. Yeah, now he's woken up. Good. Well done, Charlie. Oh, he's kiting, mate. That's good. <laughs> yeah, it's a better fish. Be right. That is a better fish. Yeah, oh, good job, mate. Good job. I don't want the hook to bend out because it's quite a small... Um, <gasps> 
quite a small hook on a fine Did wire. You see that swirl? Yeah. yeah. Oh my god, that was a massive swirl. You've got to say it with this West Country accent. That was a massive oh that was a swirl. A swirl. I'm just trying to turn the boat. She's got a lot of line out still. That's a good fish try, I think. I think it could be, yeah. I think it's good. Yeah, he didn't know it was hooked though, did he? No. What flow you got on? The little Flo's hairband. No. <laughs> yeah. Have you really? Yeah. Take your time, you've got all the time in the world, mate. It's that pate you had, that's what's done it. <laughs> <laughs> Turning the boat. Yeah, that's good though. I'm not really going under it. I'd much rather play it out there than underneath yeah, it. Let it run as many times as it wants, mate. Do you smack it real hard? No, that is a good fish. Bloody hell, he's a good fish. Is it? Yeah, I just saw him. Well, play it like any other, mate. Ooh, that's a good fish. Oh, let's go onto the boat. No, no, that's no, right, no. That's right. That's not all right, Sam. Just blow your rod a bit, you're fine. You need to come back out, you're all right. As long as you don't get the motor. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. Just come around the other side if you need that's to. That's okay, he's out. Right. Okay, here we go. Don't bully him, though. Oh, my. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm not saying what I'm thinking out loud. Oh, he almost did me then. He's playing you proper, he's trying. It's such a different experience on the fly, isn't it? Yeah. It's like they're in control until they're not. Be careful, I don't tread on the line. Yeah, don't tread on the line. Do you want me to sort it sorry, out? Sorry, sorry, Mike. Fishing out into the deeper water, wasn't it? Yeah. I still don't want to know. It's like a world, mate. It's like Which way are you coming? Try again. Oh. Whoa. That's good. Jesus. Oh, here we go. Here we don't. I'm not stabbing, mate. No, that's fine. He's tiring, definitely, because he's coming back in quicker. Yeah. Okay. Let's see if I can just get his head up. Okay. Well done, Sam. Yes, just keep him in the water, innit? Yeah. After all that, just What's talking a hit about. Like, proper? No, it felt like a little jack. No! Yeah. Oh, well done. Oh, mate, oh that's, that's bigger than 20. It, isn't it? Yeah, that is. That's bigger than 20, mate. Did you get you? Yeah, of course Thanks for unhooking it. Thanks for unhooking it. Oh, my God, mate. Nice one. Mate, that's 30. Yeah, it could be. Oh, you know, that's the... Mate, that's 30. I can't believe you thought it was a chat. It doesn't need to be, doesn't need to be zipped, mate. I can keep it. Having had that done before. Sorry about your hands. Bastards, mate. Right, she's ready. 24-14, yeah, I'll do. 24-14. Oh, that's the thingy. I was wrong, but... That is a... Uh... I don't what a 40 must look like. Cheers. Oh my god, what would a 40 look like? It is a hollow. That's what it is. Well, we persevered, we had some lunch, and we moved into the shallows and drifted out into slightly deeper water. Charlie had a bite and he thought it was a, felt like a jack. But after a minute or so, it, it woke up. It wasn't a jack. 
Yep, ready. I'm filming. Beautiful. How are you feeling, Charlie? Buzzing. <laughs> Buzzing. Mate. <sighs> I made up for you. That's great, isn't it? What a fish, mate. There he goes. I'm glad I had that pass here. I wasn't going to have any <laughs> Just thought I'd do a little video of the fly that I caught that <clears> fish <throat> on. So we've got Flo's hairband at the top, some rat minky around the body, and a, and a minky tail. It looks amazing in the water. Doesn't look so amazing now. That's what it looks like in the water. A lot better. So explain what's just happened, Charlie. Um, Sam's been trimming his flies. <laughs> He's just been getting into fly time. And he was laughing at his fly that we've called the badger. <laughs> and I waited to him a pork pie and a pound that I could catch a pike on it. And there we go. Ooh. Might only be a little one, you know, scrap. Well, the badger, <laughs> the, badger. <laughs> the badger's been christened. He's a beautiful looking fish. He's got a lovely dark head to him. Doesn't sound much fur in it. <laughs> <laughs> right. The teeth in there. Yeah. The quality of those teeth compared to the pike that you get. Just twist him around. Cool. cool. You see what I mean? Yeah. Compared to what you would get. He's a cracking little colour. Yeah. I'm going to my finger back now. I've never known such a toothy pike. Be gone. Come on, oh, Charlie. Badger. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Charlie. Oh my goodness. And that was that. A lovely day out fishing. We're still lots of areas that we've yet to properly explore and a dropped perch that's, that felt quite big actually. And that will need another look. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe or comment. It's lovely to hear from you and uh, thanks for watching. Trout fishing next, I reckon. <laughs>